Hi, welcome to Brand New School. My name is Miss Corcoran and I'm one of the teachers here of Government and Politics. Politics is an amazing subject that looks at the political changes and landscapes and government systems of the US and the UK. Over the past few decades, we've seen so much change and debate and controversy in our governments surrounding many different events and circumstances. If that's something that's interested with you, then maybe this subject is one that you'll think about choosing going to sixth form. Over the two-year course, we look at everything from the historical and background changes all the way through to contemporary and modern day events. The course is split into two parts. In year 12, we look at the background to the British Constitution. So we look at things like how the Constitution is developed, the sources of the Constitution. We then think about how Parliament is made up between the House of Commons and the House of Lords. We also think about the role of the Prime Minister and its Cabinet. We then also think about in year 12, the difference between uh, the different types of devolved bodies and also the judicial system. When we've completed that side of the course on paper one, we also look at um, the background to things like uh, political parties, pressure groups, and how campaigns work. In year uh, 13, we look at start paper two, we consider the background to the US constitution. So we look at things like how the constitution is developed, the war of independence, the founding fathers. We then look at how Congress is made up, we also think about how the president rules and runs the country in the White House. And then we also think about how the judicial, judicial system works as well. When we've done both of those sides of the course, we do what we call the comparative course as well. Thereby, we actually look at the differences between the UK and the US systems. Paper three is also part of this course and looks at the political landscape, political concepts. So we look at the history of ideologies and their impact upon them, upon the different parties that we have today. How are lessons spent? Lessons are spent with a combination of independent work, teacher-led work through PowerPoints or resources. They're also passed over to lots of one-to-one um, -one work as well. Where we'll have discussions and debates around things. We also look at how we can basically introduce lots of political ideas and work into the lessons as well. Politics will lead to lots uh, of you acquiring fantastic skills, such as interpretation, debating, analysis skills, and they'll all be really, really beneficial to you going forward, looking at, at potential careers. Lots of students in the past have gone on to study things like law at university, as well as history. Many have combined lots of their degrees with politics because they've enjoyed it so much. We've also had many subjects um, being taken, such as business or international relations on the back of completing the politics um, course at A-level. If you're interested in lots of debate, if you're interested in lots of um, current events and affairs, then politics might be the subject for you. Hope I've given you a bit of background as to what the course involves. If you have any questions, then please direct them to school. If not, I hope to see many of you in September.